Okay, so first up, what are your views on racism? My views on racism is basically... I'm not going to like you or hang out with you because I was taught not to like hang out with people like you, basically. Like, I grew up with the mentality and the, the, uh, the guidance from people that raised me to not hang out with this type of person and that type of person, which is just wrong because I have white friends, I have black friends, I have Samoan friends, I have Hispanic friends, I have all different ethnicity type of friends, but in the society that we live in, it's basically a race war every day. Like, oh, he black, he gangbang, or, or he's white, he's racist, or oh, he's Samoan, he, he, he going, you know, it's, yeah. a, it's like a misunderstanding that I think people should basically stop misunderstanding things so much and, and basically understand that people, there's good people in the world, like wherever you are, there's always gonna be good people. It's not just, it's cause he's this color, I'm gonna think he's this. It's prejudging, basically. Yeah. Basically, it's kind of like stereotypes about each person. You're yeah. just going based off of that before you get to know the person. Yeah, and that that's just wrong because it's like there's 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 some good people out here, you know, and I would be wrong to say like, oh well, since you're this ethnicity, I'm not gonna like you or we're not gonna hang out. Like that's just that's just wrong. Yeah. So then. Next question is, what are your views on jealousy? Uh, my views on jealousy are, um, you could have a friend your whole life, in, like, or have a girlfriend, or have a homeboy, homegirl, that you hang out with every day. And I mean, like, every day, you guys go get donuts together, you guys smoke weed together, whatever. Um, or a family member. And, like, Y'all kick it every day. Everything's cool. Until you find out some stuff or they, like, basically make a gesture or action. That's just like, wow, why'd you do that? Like, you know, it could be like, they'll tell your girlfriend something like, oh, you know, he did this, da -da 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 -da, she did this, and go behind your back and say something that you thought that you was just talking to that person. But jealousy is like, um... Jealousy is a bad, bad trait to have. It's like, I want what you have. Mm -hmm. Like, it's just bad. Like, <laughs> it's really, really bad. So, could you say there are like multiple forms of jealousy? Yes, there are multiple forms of jealousy. Yeah. Yep. Like, for example, if your like your boyfriend was like hanging out with some other girl. Like, they weren't even doing anything, but you still don't like that they're together. I mean, that that right there, I have some homegirls that be tripping as far as they don't want they, they do hanging out with nobody or vice versa. Um, some dudes be tripping, they don't want their girl hanging out with somebody. And I think it just all comes down to, like, trust. Like, basically, I'm going to trust you. You're going to trust me. You're not going to be thinking I'm doing something. I'm hanging out or whatever. And I'm not going to be thinking you're doing something you ain't not, basically. Yeah. So then you have that one versus, like, being jealous of what someone else has. Yeah. So that could even be, like... Like, you could have a homeboy that likes your girl behind your back, and you don't know nothing about it, but when you leave and she leave, he texting her all kind of stuff. Like, yeah, I want to hang out with you. I would like to, you know, get to know you. And that's your own homeboy. So it's like... He, it's like you never know, like, when it's going to happen or when it does happen. Yeah. So, well, this is at, like, four minutes. Is it supposed to be like that? That's cool. Okay. So then we have the third question is, what are your views on religion? My views on religion? Um, I feel like religion is, like, it messes up society basically like if this person believe in Allah or this person believe in Buddha or this person believe in Jesus or this person believe in God whoever God is to you I feel like it creates a division it's like it's a separation like I got a friend that's my close friend his name is Omar and uh he's a Muslim and uh 
other people would be like, man, you hanging out with. But me, I'm like, I go based off of your heart. Like, mm -hmm. go based off a person's heart. Like, just because you Muslim or just because you Catholic or whatever you are, whatever religion you are, I'm not going to judge you because of that. You know, I'm just going to judge mm -hmm. you from, you know, your heart and your actions. I, I feel like religion sort of separates people. Yeah. When That's kind of similar to the whole racism thing where it's like you're judging them based off of this one part of them. Yeah. And it's just like a stereotype to stay away from those. Yep. That's very true. That's mm -hmm. honestly true. That's, that's, that's literally really, that's really, really true. Yeah. Um, I just, man, it's, we all, all people, I think we should just all get together. You know, um, it should be like, we should all come together instead of like, cause I got a, I got two nieces. They're Caucasian and African American. And, um, their mother is Caucasian. I love her. I love her like, you know, like I love my black sister or my Hispanic sister. I feel like we should stop the racism because I feel like it's, it's just messes up society, you know. But um, when you go to jail, it's different, though. Like, jail is like, okay, this is the black table. This is the white table. This is the Mexican table. And you basically, it's a set of rules when you get there. You're going to have somebody tell you, um, hey, look, man, this is the phone you use. This is the shower we use. It's different. It's like in regular society, it's like racism is kind of blind. You're blinded. But in jail, it's, it's right up in your face. So. Why do you think they do that? Um, I have no idea. It sucks because it's like... I could see one of my homeboys in there, and he might be another ethnicity, and I won't be allowed to share with him because he's another ethnicity. But when we on the house, we kick it, we smoke weed together and everything. But, it, yeah, it's crazy. It's hella crazy. Like, it's so sad. it's the people that are in jail that are causing that segregation, not the actual jail system? Yeah. Um, I think the system is doing that. Yeah? I don't think it's the people in there. Um... But they're, they're, they're dictating and going off what the system says to do and yeah. then things like that. But um, so they just go along with it. They just go along with it. It's been it's been happening for years. So it's like I, I can't say that the people are doing it. I have to say that the system is doing it. It's built up like that, you know, because a, a a cop ain't on. They, they stop. No, yeah, <laughs> oh, like 